How's it going everybody, it's the man, the myth, the legend Quad MFT here and in today's video I'll be bringing you guys a little bit of the new game mode and a little bit of gameplay in it. This is the new game mode arms race. Now I'm sure many of you guys have probably already enjoyed playing this game mode. I know a lot of people do really like it, some people they don't really like it, it doesn't really make too big of a difference in their Call of Duty careers. But for me right now I feel like this is the only game mode that I'm playing. Now I'm sure again this isn't the first ever time you guys have any seen, uh, seen any gameplay of this on anyone's channel. Probably most of you guys have played this before again but the cool thing about this game mode is I'm sure you guys know 6v6 team deathmatch that's the game mode that we all started out in when we were originally a bunch of noobs because that's sure I mean maybe even a few of you guys are still noobs right now but you know you can go way back when and you were a noob and all you did was play team deathmatch I mean honestly even I know I did back way back when in world at war modern warfare 2 all I did was play team deathmatch all day thinking I was the coolest kid around trading off every single game with my little brother he back then he used to like to play a lot but now he doesn't really get into it too much he does other stuff nowadays but one thing else that I one thing else that I really like about the game mode arms race is back in, back in the uh, in the beginning of Black Ops 2 you'd only get 100 points every time you get a kill in team deathmatch so it would take you forever to earn any type of score streak I mean to get just a swarm just a simple little swarm I mean of course it's not too simple it's the hardest score streak to get in the game I mean that's if you don't consider the nuclear score streak which it's not it's just a little metal that you earn I mean other people consider it a score streak and stuff like that I mean nobody else really knows when you get a nuclear unless you post it on YouTube or type it in the chat on that that's only if you're playing on PC but it is the hardest score streak to get possible and that's 19 that's 19 kills in a row guys that's 19 kills in a row in team deathmatch that's really really hard to do in team deathmatch so in this new game mode arms raced I'm not sure if it's staying forever we haven't really heard any news if it's completely gonna be going away in two or three days I really do hope it stays though but we haven't heard any news if it's gonna be going away either so what it does is you actually get 150 points instead of 100 points for each kill in team deathmatch which means every time you get a, a basically two kills or even just a double kill you get 300 points guys that that's a ton that if you get three kills that's already a UAV I mean imagine with hardline on I'm not sure if two kills with hardline on is a quite a, is quite a UAV in arms race someone make sure to tell me that down in the comment section below but guys tell me your favorite game mode because right now I am definitely enjoying arms race now again why I like arms race so much is mainly because the fact it is really fast paced and it's a lot more fast paced than 6v6 team deathmatch I mean of course arms race is 6v6 you know that would be really really cool that'd be really cool if they were able to add a 99s arms race I mean I know we're already asking a lot from Treyarch considering they used to not do a lot but now they really like supporting their games and I really enjoy that they support the games considering I'm definitely an avid player of Black Ops 2 and I was a Black Ops 1 in World at War but again guys tell me what your favorite game mode is down in the comment section below I like arms race mainly because of the fact it's fast paced and you can get your score streaks really fast now I don't like to brag or be cocky or anything but I basically top most lobbies that I play in at least the most public lobbies I mean but of course I don't always top every single league play game because there are a lot of really talented people who play a lot of league plays such as like nade shot and scump and people like that but I really do enjoy just being able to get my score streaks really easily and being able to rack up a ton of points you can see right there I get RPG and you can tell when you're completely dominating the other team I don't think I was going too crazy in this gameplay I think this is one of the first times I played arms race so I was just having a little bit of fun trying to figure out the game mode and just really hang out and have a good time and enjoy the overall game mode of arms race so what I did was I set the orbital VSAT the escort drone and the warthog now why I decided to set the orbital VSAT the escort drone and the warthog was again the orbital VSAT tells me where the enemies are at and it also tells my friendlies where the enemies are at the people on my team it tells them where the enemies are at so again that makes it really fast pace but when the enemy team when they get an orbital vsat come on guys i mean we all know that's just really annoying nobody likes it when the enemy team gets an orbital vsat and something else that i find just a little bit funny is when i when, when your enemies try and take out your orbital vsat now that's just hilarious when they're new to the game and stuff like that and like oh i hear enemy vsat online let me try and take it down and it, you, you just kind of chuckle and laugh at them but guys don't forget to tell me your favorite game mode down in the comment section below again right now this is probably my favorite game mode i love arms race if i could suggest just you guys probably run the higher score streaks because you're going to be able to pull them off really easily in this game mode just mainly because the fact that you get 150 points every every kill and that's not including getting an orbital vsat assist or getting kills with your score streaks or being able to get assists and concussions assists and like that stuff like that so i hope you guys enjoyed this video remember to give me a big thumbs up down below if we could try and hit 150 likes on this video that'd be really cool add this video to your favorites if it was one of your favorite videos also go ahead and make sure to follow me on twitter and instagram links in the description below also so go ahead and like my Facebook page, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. It's been Quadum FT, and I'll see you next time.